Tracy and I'm here with another shopping haul. I didn't really get too much. I just was on my way to the Dollar Tree and then I went to the grocery outlet and then I found a yard sale. So I'm going to show you what I picked up and I'm going to show you the stuff that I found today at a yard sale. Now I can do like separate videos if you guys want to see the stuff that I've picked up like over the weekend. I could do a video that way or I could just throw it in here and there. So let me know in the comments what you guys would like. I could do like a yard sale Saturday or yard sale Sunday, something like that. So let me know. So, okay, Dollar Tree. I picked up this little bottle of bleach. I know it's not a good value, but I my washing machine broke and I got ripped off. I paid this guy $150 for a new machine that didn't work. And of course, he's nowhere to be found. So I got ripped for 150 bucks and now I have another machine and it works it's just fine and um, but it's weird because the bleach thing where you pour it in when I like to wash my dog stuff that is the opposite side and it's really awkward the angle to like pour the bleach in and I don't want to splash it all over my clothes and everything so I figured if I bought this then I just keep the bottle and refill the bottle then I got, this is a repurchase, the Popcorners Carnival Kettle. I really like these, they're really good. And then, I, this is new, I had never seen this before. It's Blueberry Lemonade, the Weilers. It's a 10 pack of the little um, things that you put in the water. And if I look like hot, I am. It's like 100 degrees here today and it's, it's hot. So, anyway. I picked up one of the baby bottle brushes so that I can clean the um, glass bottles that I hauled a while back that I put the juice or the drink, drink sticks in. So I wanted to get this to clean that those out. And then I picked up these sunglasses because I was waiting in line and of course they have the display there so you can like shop while you wait. So I thought these were really cute and then they have flowers like a floral print on the sides and they're like a red kind of color. So for a dollar, I can, because I always lose sunglasses. I don't ever bonus pay, pay too much because I lose them. And then I picked up these Weiler's Italian Ices. Um, they're strawberry, blueberry, berry lemonade, and cherry. So I haven't tried these before, so I'm going to pop them in my freezer and see how they are. Then when I went to the grocery outlet, they had my husband and my favorite candy is the Butterfinger Mini Cups, and these were 50 cents. So that's a really good deal. And then they had this Mrs. Finster's Cookie Thins in sea salt caramel. Anybody that knows me knows that I love sea salt caramel. So these were 99 cents. So that was all I got from the Dollar Tree and the grocery outlet. Now, the yard sale that I stopped at, I got this t-shirt. <laughs> it says Angel Soft Dixie and Sparkle. It's brand new, never worn, never washed. It's a size extra large, and this is what I like to wear to sleep in. So, got that for 50 cents, and then I picked up these skinny jeans. These were 50 cents as well, and they are by a brand 88 Perfect Jeans. So, they'll either be for me or my daughter. We both like skinny jeans. And then I got this pair. They're skinny and kind of distressed as well. They have that this kind of cool little thing going on here and these are called almost famous is the brand and then I got this pair I think this is going to be too big for either one of us so I'm going to pass it along to somebody that is this size and these are by the brand South Pole so they're I think they're too big but for 50 cents like I couldn't pass it up and then I got these, which are also probably too big. These are just like a pair of, uh, I don't know what you call these, um, walking short. Or they're not really capri, but they're not like a long jean. So that was all I picked up today on my travels. Um, if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know if you have any ideas of things that you'd like to see from me or anything you'd like me to try out. And let me know on the yard sale thing if you'd like me to do like a thing every weekend or how you'd like to see that or just like to see it thrown in with the Dollar Tree. So thank you for watching. I'm glad you stuck around and I will see you in my next one. Bye. Hi guys. I just had a couple items that I bought. Not enough for me to do a complete video on. So I just wanted to throw it in at the end of this video. 
I went to the Dollar Tree today and I found these two headbands. They're made by Scunchy. Scun I don't know how you pronounce it. It's a name brand, you know, have it at Walmart and stuff. I've never seen any kind of name brand hair products at any of the Dollar Trees around here. So there was a couple different things, but I got these little headbands to probably give one to my daughter. Maybe both. I don't know. We'll see. So these were really cute. And then I picked up another one of the little cute wax melt cubes. I noticed that they're, they've got new ones in now and they're only giving you four cubes instead of the six. So keep your eye out if you like these that, and make note that they're downsizing them, I believe, because I've only been seeing the four packs. So if you see the six packs, you like them, grab them. And then I went to Walmart and I wanted to see if they had the, the kettle corn wax melts and they didn't. They had so many though, I was really surprised. Then a six pack there is $2. And I picked up the iced lemon sugar cookie Oh my gosh, it smells so good. But they also have, this is the Sensationals, and they had, I think, Better Homes and Gardens, and then they had like a maybe a Walmart type brand, and they had six cubes, and they were like smaller, and they were like 97 cents. So I might try those ones too. If anybody's tried the smaller ones and th that are like a dollar, let me know how the throw is on them. But these this smells amazing, so hopefully it'll work out. And then I also picked up the new, um, or, well, I don't know if it's new, new to me, Maybelline Fit Me Pressed Powder, Matte and Poreless. I, my skin's normal, so I'm not worried about matte, but with summer coming, um, I just wanted, you know, a powder. So if I, because I don't put foundation on all the time. So I picked this up in the 310 Sun Beige. So I'll give that a try. It was like $5.97, I believe. Anyhow, that's all I got. So I'm going to stick this in with my other video. Uh, if you like this, please give it a big thumbs up. If you want to see more content like this, make sure you hit that red subscribe button below and hit the bell so that you'll be notified every time I upload a no new video. And I upload on Monday and Thursday. Okay, I'll see you in my next one. Bye. <laughs>